here I have Google Pixel XL and let me show you how to set up this device. As you can see, here I have the welcome panel. Here you can choose the desired language. This is the full list of available languages that you can use. So in my case, let me choose English from United Kingdom. Here you can change some vision settings if you would like to, or you can use the emergency call. All right, so now let's choose start if you are ready. You can connect your device to mobile network by using a SIM card or you can skip it and activate your device without uh, the SIM card. You may also connect your device to a Wi-Fi, it's not necessary but I usually recommend this step because the internet access enables some interesting features so let me connect my device. Now the phone is checking for the available updates. In my case, let me go back or let me connect to some other Wi-Fi network to have the stronger signal. So let me connect to another one. Now let's choose connect. In my case, the device obtaining the IP address and the phone is looking for updates. As you can see now, everything goes smoothly. So here you can copy apps and data from some other device or you can set up your device as a new, so let me do it. You can sign in into the Google account. It's not necessary, but uh, you can have some interesting features by using the Google account, so let me do it. Let's enter the email. All right, let's choose next. Let's enter the password. Now let's go next and tap agree to agree terms of service and privacy policy. So let's skip uh, using the fingerprint protection in my case. Let me also skip setting the screen lock, skip anyway. Tap skip one more time. Here you can enable or disable the couple of Google services, for example, backup to Google Drive, free up space, help us find your location, improve location accuracy, help the uh, help to send system data to improve the Android experience and other stuff. Let me agree to all of them and choose no thanks to the following uh, accounts settings. And as you can see, the home screen pops up. So now you can use your device in a normal way. Thank you for watching, please subscribe our channel and leave thumbs up under the video.